Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying the Wickedly Prime. I have honey sesame roasted cashews and okay. coconut toffee roasted cashews. And mine are hot for jalapeno sunflower seeds. Now these are, uh, you can buy the Wickedly Prime brand on Amazon. It's an Amazon brand. Uh, these were sent to us from Mona in Michigan. She ordered these online for us and wanted us to try them. From Amazon. From yeah. Amazon. And so we're going to try the honey sesame roasted cashews, roasted and sprinkled with sesame seeds, which we both love oh, sesame so seeds. No artificial flavors, no chemical preservatives. It says sesame flavor really comes through in this combination. Small bits of crunchiness, sweetly surrounding cashews. Honey roasting brings out the buttery taste of the cashews and provides a nice balance for the savory seed coating. In closing, it's addictively tasty. 11 servings are in the package. A fourth of a cup or 30 grams is 180 calories. It is in a resealable bag. Always not. Oh, they're just literally cashews covered in yes, sesame seeds, sesame basically. Seeds. I the love texture. the texture. Got the typical soft cashew texture with a little bit of that crunch of the sesame seeds. I like those. Those are good. I think those are delicious. Mm -hmm. it, are they all sesame seeds? Because that mm -hmm. looks like a... Yeah, it's sesame seeds. No, I mean uh, cashews. Yeah. Mm, those are really good. I was honestly expecting the, the, the sesame to be a little stronger, but but I'm not complaining because it's very, very good. They're delicious. If I was going to add one thing, I might add a little bit of salt. Yeah. But I think they're delicious. I agree. I agree with them. I really do like those. I'm, 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 I'm a nut fanatic, so. And you're left with the taste of that sesame taste, so it's really good. So these are the coconut toffee, caramelized and co coated in... Uh, coconut. <laughs> Ro they're roasted cashews. They are one fourth of a cup is 170 calories, but you get 32 grams of this, where you only get 30 grams of yours and you're less calories. Okay. Interesting. Did you want to read in the back? Or? No, I'm good. So we, we like coconut, we like toffee. I love toffee. A buttery rich depth of sweet flavor is created when you combine coconut and sugar. Ooh, these are bigger cashews. So Probably the, why you um, more weight. the honey sesame were just pieces. These are actually whole cashews. Oh wow. These have like a, a crispy coating on the outside of them. That's the topping. Oh, I love those. Those are good. Who would have known cashews and coconut go together? But they do really well. Oh boy. Those are gonna be dangerous. Yeah. Mm. Those are real, those are excellent. I I'm gonna say also the only thing that could add to that is a little bit of salt. I think they're perfect. <laughs> I can't even tell you how good those are. Those you'll see those again in the monthly favorites. That's yeah, because they're very very good. Like but those good. are awesome. Yeah, they're very good. All right, now this one's gonna be interesting. These are hot for jalapeno sunflower seeds. They're sprouted sunflower seeds with um, spiro spirulina. Spirulina. Spinach. Cholera. It looks like cholera. It does look like cholera. Uh, Himalayan salt and spice. or organic, gluten-free, vegan, and sprouting. Uh, they are fourth of a cup. 28 grams is 160 calories. Um, oh, that's a good idea. Put uh, season to kick up your salads. Oh, yeah. In a, in a mm -hmm. salad. That would be really good. Well, I I've think, always loved some flower kernels in, in a salad. Mm -hmm. See, I don't, I've never really did that. I mean, maybe when I was in a salad bar where you I, get all yeah, kinds of stuff. Yeah, that's when I did it. was on a salad bar. But I would never actually just go buy sunflower seeds just to put on a salad. You know? Now, I wonder how hot these are going to be. I can tell you, it feels like grass seed. Mm -hmm. You know when you spread grass seed? Mm -hmm. That's very nice. And it's not, it's not hot. I don't think it's hot. The spicy sprite some places are just the tiny ticket when you're looking for a satisfying snack. It will bring the heat. I don't really get heat. 
But jalapenos are... I don't get heat, but I, I get some of the flavor. Yeah. I, I like those. I think those are good. Those would probably, out of the three, that would be my, my least favorite. Yeah, because by I themselves, do, they don't... Right. I think by themselves, they're kind of boring, but I think if you do if you put them on a salad, I do see where they would be really, really good on a yeah. salad. I wonder why they didn't make them as spicy as they could have. I don't well, know, I but I, we have some salad, so I'm sure that's where we'll be using mm -hmm. them, is just to, even though we bought some pre-made salads, you can put a mm -hmm. scoop or two of want. those, a tablespoon of those, and those would be really good. Yeah, My I'm, favorite of the three is the Oh the yeah, but I'm, there's not even any question about it. But I wonder why they're saying hot for jalapeno, when I don't even really get a, I mean, there might be a slight, 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 slight heat. Very, very slight. But there's no heat flavor of jalapeno. Mm -hmm. they, I think they missed the mark a little bit with these. I as far as what they say they are. No, I, I agree. Think they miss. I agree. But they're good. Yeah, they're good, but they're not yeah. jalapeno. I think I get the more of a spinach flavor than that. Than the jalapeno. Than the jalapeno. Isn't that weird? Yeah. Well, the coconut by far is, is number one. It, I mean, it, like they're just here. phenomenal. <laughs> and these are delicious too. They are very good. But well. the coconut, you just can't beat it. Mm -hmm. So thank you so much, Mona, for sending these to us. If you all uh, I'll have a link below where you can order them. Um, so check them out if you want to. And thanks for watching.